Can you use artificial intelligence for video editing? More specifically, can Copilot be used with Adobe After Effects? The answer is yes. In this video, I'm going to show you how I animated the text. Um, basically, I made this, the text slide from right to left in After Effects using Copilot. Let's see how. So, um, let's see everything I tried. First of all, I tried to Okay, let's state the problem. I have this video uh, about my recent vlog to Melbourne, which I didn't publish yet, by the way. It's taking forever to merge all the videos. And I wanted to have this text over here slide from right to left, but I didn't want to do it manually. So I was wondering if Copilot can, can help me with that. And uh, I went to Copilot and the first question I asked was this one write an After Effects script that slide a text from right to left, which is pretty generic. And the first reply by Copilot was telling me all the instructions they have to do in After Effects, which is good, but still I wanted the exact software script, the code to do that. So the second question I ask is write me the script code. And Copilot reply with the actual code. Now this code has um, is After Effects specific, uh, but the, um, when I try to run it, there were a few there were a few errors. So um, it was not a perfect code. So the second attempt that I did after asking this question was to download uh, Visual Studio Code software here. I can even tell you. So I downloaded this Visual Studio Code and I copy and paste the, uh, the code that Copilot gave me into uh, the editor and I removed the first part, which I didn't need because it was to create a composition, but I already had a composition. And I commented this part, which is about rendering settings, which I can specify manually, it's not a problem. However, there were a few errors uh, in the code. For example, um, this value was wrong. And uh, uh, when I tried to import it in After Effects, I got uh, a prompt, an error prompt by After Effects. So I, this is the, the th second th thing I tried. So I copy and paste it in here. I tried to save it as a JSX file. As you can see here, I tried several attempts. And then I tried to run the script in After Effects here, clicking on File, Scripts, Run Script File. Now, if you already uh, run a lot of scripts in After Effects, you will probably uh, be able to edit it right away here. But anyway, when I tried to run it, I had uh, many uh, I think three issues and I try basically to ask Copilot to fix it. So here I try to tell him there is an error on line 28. This is the error, can you fix it? And Copilot tried to fix it, but it was not effective. So I insisted there is still an error on, on at line 28. Try it again, but it was not effective. So the third thing I tried was to ask the direct code for the text. So this is the element I want to animate. And here in position, you can actually specify scripts. So instead of running the script through file scripts and run script file, you can actually uh, click here. And if you select this one and the drop down menu over here, here you can uh, paste, basically you can uh, add the script. So then I try Copilot to ask, I already have a text object, just give me the code to add to the position property to make the text slide from right to left in one second. And finally, he gave me the code, the correct code. So this code worked and uh, it allowed me to animate the text from right to left. So as you can see here, we will try it right away. So I will select this, I'll copy and paste it. 
Uh, at the beginning, there was one error, I remember. Yes, here, because the, it doesn't find, find the layer. And by the way, this is something that Copilot specified over here. So you have to read also what it tells you, not only the code. And yeah, so I have to replace text layer with the right layer, which is Melbourne Sky Deck. Okay, this is the wrong place. <laughs> is here. And then I press play. And here it is. So it made the text slide, as I asked. Of course, as you can notice, this is not the um, ending position I wanted, but this is something we can fix, easily fix. So I just ask Copilot, please correct the ending position to one third of the width of the video. And he gave me a new code. And I copy and paste this part without the generic text layer. And I animate it again. Okay, I have to go back. And I press play. And here it is. So it gave me a different ending. And here, of course, you can ask Copilot for their directives, like um, specify different positions, specify the time it takes to slide, if it is one second, two seconds, and so on. So in the end, this worked. And um, I just tried, tried with this simple use case, but you can try with more use cases. So as you can see, it's possible actually to use Copilot even for video editing in After Effects.